Welcome back everyone, it's Austin Tatius here and today's video is going to be an S-Class Alien mid-rifle with a really nice uh, purple crystal and a sea green finish on the skin. Um, so quite a quick video, this is currently uh, in Euclid Galaxy, so this is the starting galaxy. Uh, you'll need to use a portal in Euclid in order to get here, um, so make sure that you're you're already in Euclid when uh, putting in the glyphs for this um, location. The space station cabinet is a natural A-class and obviously isn't the tool that we're after. Um, so that's the station's um, A-class multi-tool. Um, the planet which we're going to fly to is one of three in this system and it's this one here. It's called um, I Say No Icon, I see no icon, um, and the coordinates will be at the top of your screen. If you just bear with me, I'll quickly grab them. You're going to go to minus 37.53 and minus 96.10. So from the space station, basically head towards the bottom right of the planet, but this is going to be your portal planet. Um, so you, you will be spawning on this planet. Uh, just the first thing that you need to do, um, or at least before you go to pick the tool up, just make sure that you reload a save on this planet. Uh, this, the uh, the S-Class alien tool is part of this planet's multi-tool pool so you will need to reload a save that's the only way that you can get the tool to spawn into the cabinet it's also got a giant sandworm on this planet as well so there's your coordinates again minus 37.53 and minus 96.10 so I've jumped out the ship created the save and now I'm going to reload that save. Just once again you must make sure to reload a save either a manual or auto save to see this tool. Right, and here it is. So as you can see, really nice colours. It's called the Ancestral Loop Atomizer, and it's an S-Class alien mid-rifle with a sea green skin and a purple crystal uh, clip and barrel. So this is your first person. It would have been nicer if it had the spikes on top at the rear. But it's still quite a nice tool. And then just in this dark patch. So here is it. Here it is from all angles. Sixteen slots. Damage potential standard aliens a four three three. If they don't have any uh, gun attachments pre-installed, which this this one has the blaze javelin, but that doesn't affect the damage output. So it it will be standard four three three point three. Experimentals a four hundred, and aliens a four three three point three. And last but not least, the glyphs. So the glyphs that you'll need are at the bottom left of your screen now. So those glyphs at the bottom left, they will bring you directly to this planet. As soon as you come through the portal, just reload your auto save or put a save beacon down, save on the save beacon and then reload the manual save and then just head straight to this um, settlement and it will be here. 
so yeah, planet details on the left and resources and coordinates on the right. And that is it for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll hopefully see you in the next one as well. Take care and enjoy the rest of your week. We're nearly at the weekend. Have a good one.